Hello, thank you so much for joining me in. I thought I will share with you a little bit of a behind the scenes of, of a bigger launch uh, for us today. So today is, is a big day. We've We've been kind of waiting for it for, for some time, even deliberating a lot whether we should go and do it today or not. Um, but today we are launching brand new presets that Mike has been very excited to work on for mm, quite some time. Uh, so the only caveat to all of that is the fact that we are launching them as a pre-sale and we can't release them until Adobe releases the update, which we don't know when it's going to happen. Hence, all of our kind of, should we do it, should we not, um, thoughts behind all of this. Uh, but we thought, okay, we're going to do this and let's just have our fingers crossed that uh, Adobe is going to press the you know, release button as soon as possible. Um, so fingers crossed it will be, it will all work out okay. But um, yes, so doing a kind of larger launch like, like this one does require quite a lot of work uh, on our end. It's exciting, but at the same time, it could be a little bit stressful. We did have a, a few moments with Mike when it was like, ah, no, we shouldn't do it like that, you know. As you do, it's only human, right? Um, but I think we have covered all the bases. So when you are working on a bigger launch like that, it's just so important to kind of try and pull together everything you have. And and for us, it, it was a little bit like that. We, we were thinking, okay, what can we utilize? Obviously, Mike's YouTube channel is is quite important to us. He's got uh, way over 100,000 followers there now, a, a huge, big, devoted audience to to what he does. So, so obviously, that's number one priority. Hence, we are doing the live stream later today. Um, I feel a little bit nervous in the sense that, wow, you know, it's it, it's kind of, you know, I'm, I'm first time for the first time I'm actually part of it in that sense that I'm I'm live on the camera with Mike. In the past, I was always the person in, in the background, you know, checking things, giving him a little notepads like this one. So this is this is usually what happens. I would write things on a white piece of paper and just flash it in front of his eyes. <laughs> but I won't be doing that today <laughs> because the spotlight will also be on me. So we do have um, our team members supporting us in the background as well, which is fantastic. It's great to have that. But it's just to show you that, you know, it's like even though things can look very professional, sometimes you do resort to just these. I still remember the days when, when Mike was doing a launch. I think it was actually our previous presets. And I remember just sneaking into his room because we weren't together in the office like that and just, just pushing pieces of paper in front of him and he was just like trying to have a little look from the corner of his eye so so it's just funny you know it's one of those things that uh, I do have um, a good memories of but today obviously I'm going to be joining him on the live stream so I feel a little bit nervous uh, that uh, you know he, he has so many more hours of in front of camera experience and I do have far far less than that so so it makes me a bit nervous but I'm sure we will be fine so um YouTube, obviously, now our number one um, priority today in that sense. We also have a mailing list. So so our um, subscribers would have already gotten uh, quite a few emails from us advising them on that big launch during the live stream later today. And we do have uh, a faithful group of people who already bought the preset. So obviously, we want to make sure to look after those guys too um, and uh, give them a little bit more of an exclusive treatment as they are existing customers. Uh, and and we, we obviously appreciate them very much. So this has all been going on in MRC Studios this week. Uh, there has been uh, a lot of work and there still is so much more, even though we are just literally hours um, away from, from the, the big live stream and official launch. There has been just so much and it's it's interesting because even though I well we are the main people within Music Radio Creative obviously we have a lot of support within us but it's interesting as when when you get to that point you kind of have to be everything all at once so you know I had to step into the shoes of a, a web designer and developer and copywriter um, just kind of a lot of things that I do have experience of, but when it in the bigger launch, it kind of all comes together and, and you have to really take all the strengths you have and, and push through it. So it's been rather exhausting week, let's just say. I'm glad it's Friday and I'm glad that we have the launch uh, just around the corner from us. 
And I have, in all of this, I've been trying to find little pieces of time where I can actually sit down and do some production. Uh, I had quite a lot of very deftly stares from Mike saying, what do you want now? And <laughs> asking Mike, how do you do this in an Adobe edition? <laughs> but we did get through it. Uh, and I'm glad that I've managed to actually get some audio production in this week. Uh, I'm actually having a ton of fun with this. To be honest with you, I did not anticipate that I would like it so much. I said to Mike this morning when we are dropping our kids off to school, I said, do you know what? I actually cannot wait to sit down in front of audition and just play around. It's like, to me at the moment, it's it's absolutely pure joy of just playing around and having a lot of fun with what is available inside um, Adobe Audition and with all the different tools and sound effects. We have enormous library. Our library probably has way over like 20,000 different elements. So it's like huge and I'm trying to find my way around it, trying to get my favorites out there and sort of have them easily accessible when I do production to make it a little bit faster. But today I have tackled in um, a kind of like a let's call it an epic trailer. I don't know how epic it is. I will leave it to your uh, to your judgment, perhaps. But I wanted to to play a little bit more with that kind of bigger deeper sound. Um, one thing that I haven't been doing much of and I really want to get into because I'm aware that there is so much more that I can do with is actually adding more sound effects. So yes, you have movie uh, movies, m uh, music, but I wanted to add a little bit more in terms of sound effects because there, there are different effects you can put on sound effects and I do want to get into that a little bit more because I think there is more for me to learn. So I've tried to do a little bit more of that. I've been playing. I love um, one of the libraries we use and I absolutely love it is Sennheiser I they do you can get like different samples from them and I do they if you watch if you're on the mailing list you can get packages for very little they often have like five dollar sales and you can get really amazing sounding stuff for very very little uh, so if if you are audio producer yourself and you are always looking for fresh elements just go to Zenheiser and check out uh, just make sure to sign up to the newsletter um, there, there are always discounts so like I never buy things in full price in this store I always wait for the discounts and they they have usually at the weekends they have those five dollar product hunts so you can just go around their website and get a package that I don't know sometimes sell for, sells for like hundred dollars for only five bucks so it's actually really good um so i've this is this is so far my favorite when it comes to sound effects themselves so i've been pulling those in in my productions today um and just having fun and really playing playing around so i hope next week is going to give me more opportunities to to actually be hands down on the production side of things and learn a little bit more but I, at the moment i feel like this big sponge so i'm just kind of taking in literally everything that comes uh, i hope you enjoy it i hope you have a wonderful weekend and if you can join us today join us at 2 p.m uk time uh, we will be live on um the main uh YouTube channel, uh, Mike's YouTube channel. I'll post a link um, in the description here. And yeah, have a lo lovely weekend. Coming soon. Coming soon. To Radio Cabin, Elwood's movie classics. Your favorite movie scores from 9 p.m. every Monday night, starting November 12th, right here on 94.6 FM. Sit back and get lost in the movies.